Upadacitinib is a, another oral selective JAK inhibitor, also studied in a phase two randomized double-blind placebo-controlled trial, looking at 67 adults with, again, moderate to severe atopic dermatitis. This was a little bit different, and, hard, and that's why it's very difficult, almost impossible to fully compare the results of this study with the baricitinib results because there were no topical steroids used in this study. There was no active run-in period with topical corticosteroids. But at week 16, patients were also re-randomized. They were able to get access to the upadacitinib even if they had gotten placebo early on. Really quite early as well in terms of the, the efficacy uh, was demonstrated that there are significant improvements of the eczema area and severity uh, index seen actually quite early, but continued out out week 32 as well. A dose-dependent effect where the highest dose of upadacitinib of 30 milligrams uh, was uh, you know, more robust in its efficacy compared to the lower doses, but all doses were more effective than uh, placebo. And this pattern held up for a variety of different endpoints that were examined in terms of uh, easy 50, easy 75, easy 90, improvements of itch, patient-reported outcomes, etc. There were some uh, serious adverse events in terms of infection, but this is something that I think in order to understand that more, we're going to need larger scale phase three studies to sort of elucidate that. And so those studies are underway and hopefully we'll have readouts soon.